Good morning, everyone. It is 839 right now. Welcome back to Iowa Live. Lou and Michelle here. Hopefully your Monday is going in a great fashion. But I'll tell you one thing uh, is going in a great fashion is tickets to an event that is happening uh, coming up on Sunday, Michelle, that we mentioned last week and want to make sure we talk a little bit about it again today. That's right. We have Tammy Kulbeck, the executive director at the Iowa State Center here to talk all about the upcoming performances and uh, some maybe some great gift ideas for yes, people as yes, well. Yes, that sounds great. So well, let's start with Sunday. So Sunday at 6 p.m. Um, if your family's already coming to town, it's a great way to get out of the house mm -hmm. before you spend nice thing four to or have five planned. whole days <laughs> exactly. together. Because, you know, with, with, with Christmas falling the way it does, does a lot of people right. coming in town this weekend. You're exactly. exactly correct. Exactly. And so before you're shut in the house with them for, you know, Monday and Tuesday <laughs> and Wednesday, come and see a show, right? Right. And it's a great way to kick off the holiday season uh, as you're as we're so close to Christmas. And um, the Nutcracker is uh, a, a traditional, you know, a lot yes. of people like to go see that every yes. year with the family. Yep. And we finished that up this weekend, mm -hmm. and so now it's uh, Cirque Magical Christmas. So again, aerialists, acrobats, lots of color, lots of activity. We still have some great, I think we have maybe four on stage tickets left. Now They're explain selling. what that is. Yes, well, it means so you are right on stage. Okay. So you're sitting on the wings. And you are right on stage with the performers. Wow. And you I may realize that. or may not be part of the show. Really? So they might say, hey, get up on the trapeze. Uh, uh, no, 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 no. You won't be flying. <laughs> you might be holding something, though. Oh, really? You might get a ball toss to you, yeah. So um, so if you really want a special experience, we do have a few of the onstage seats left. Now, how do they go about finding those? Because yep. I know some people that would, would love to do that. Yep, they can, they can find them on online at Ticketmaster.com or they can call our ticket office and our ticket office is 515-294-2479 or just Ticketmaster.com. Could you imagine the, the view that you would have if you were on stage? For those people who have never seen a Cirque show before, it, it's mind-blowing, it's jaw-dropping, but to be that close then and watch them perform right in front of your eyes is going to have to be spectacular. Right, yeah, and, and just um, creating that memory. Oh, and it I mean, definitely it doesn't will. Happen Talk very about because the Cirque show itself is always just spectacular and magical. Yes. Talk about kind of the, just the what makes the holiday aspect of it. Well, I think what makes it so nice is you know you obviously you're right the Cirque piece is there, but they weave in the Christmas and the holiday traditions with it. Mm -hmm. I mean, it just seems brighter and sparkly. Oh. And if we could find our magical. Um, tree ornament mm. <laughs> <laughs> that we had it, it was would, floating it would this weekend yeah. yeah it would yeah. reflect the color and the and the just the sparkliness of the show i guess is what i call it but it'll just be a burst of color um yeah. it'll be great yeah but yeah, that's gonna, gonna be a lot of fun. another and, great and show. those tickets still are available yep still are available okay. we still have some seats left yep besides the ones on stage okay so that could be uh, either a little added, added bonus might be be, uh, be a little early stocking stuffer you can uh, let people right. take a peek at yes. uh, before christmas itself but maybe you're saying i still need something uh, for the holidays. I still need to get somebody something for the holidays. You yeah. have just the ticket. Yeah, we do. We have a number of shows on sale right now. And on Friday, Allison Krauss went up. Right. And so for those of you who may not know, Allison Krauss is a bluegrass country star. Um, superstar. Superstar, yes. Uh, she uh, has been is a 27-time Grammy Award winner. Um, and she's coming on May 17th, so another Sunday night to get out of the house. Um, as I was telling Lou earlier, we had a bot attack us, actually. And about this is real. This, this, is, this is, real. is a real thing. We want to talk about this because yes. a lot of times people say, oh, we don't want to mention that, but you guys want to let people know that if they try right. to buy tickets and they may have had a little bit of difficulty, you you have that situation corrected. Right, yes. So Explain how that, were, what happened. If you were going online to purchase tickets on Friday for Alice, and Krauss and you got in line and uh, at 12.03 we were really in good shape moving tickets along then all of a sudden we had about 1500 tickets go into what we call a question mark mode which means that people are looking at those and they're in a cart and they can't be purchased by anyone else at that point. 
And so that is unusual. Mm -hmm. uh, so we got on the phone with Ticketmaster, our ticket uh, provider, and they took a look at it. We were getting hit by a bot. And so they worked with us to get all those seats cleared back up. And by 1230, we were back to normal selling. And so if any of you were out there buying tickets right at that time and you didn't buy because you thought the seats weren't very good, we've opened those all back up. All right, and so, so yeah. some of those have moved because we moved them throughout the weekend. Mm -hmm. But um, if you were trying, please try again. More available. Okay. Yeah, so that shows you the popularity of the show. Right, yes. You know, people, everybody wants to get them and then uh, a bot yes. tried to and get them Yes, and a bot, too. yes. Yeah. Uh, when you have shows that uh, brokers think are going to sell, um, that's a good thing, a, yet it's not great for our fans. But you caught it, though. But we caught it. That's, we a, got that's it a great thing. Yep. You guys caught that. All right. Yep. All right. So we'll we have again. we have Allison Krauss. Yes, yeah, so we have Allison Krauss. Year. And then, so if you're looking for tickets, then for gifts, we have just even in January, February, and March, we have a ton of shows going on. So we start on January 17th with the color purple. Right. The Broadway show, mm -hmm. part of our series. And then the very next night, we have Dwight Yoakam. Mm, how about uh, that? Yeah, very excited. It'll be his first time in the building. And uh, Is it really? Yeah, I, yes. That's hard to believe. Yes. So um, we're very excited uh, to have Dwight in. He, again, is a legend. He really is. No question so about that. We're very excited about him. And then Tedeschi Trucks Band is coming back. For those of you who don't know me, I am a huge TTB fan. <laughs> and well, this she even is calls our, it TTB. Yeah, yeah TTB, yes. Yeah. Yes, you know, the, the, um, and uh, they'll be coming back for the third time in four years. And each year, their popularity in our building has grown. So um, we What's still have so a What's so special about them that, that makes you like them so uh, much? They are just a great live band. I mean, I love their uh, CD, their recorded music, but they are a jam band. And it's Susan Chedeshke and Derek Trucks combined their bands, got married, and then five years later combined their bands. And it's a full band. Both sets of bands are on. There's probably 12 to 14 musicians and vocalists on stage. Wow. It's just a magical night with them. Yeah. I use the word magical a lot since we have Magical Start Christmas, but it's a great night. So, so if you haven't heard of them, you need to come see them. How does that work? If uh, Let's say I want to get a gift for somebody, um, but I don't know what show they would prefer. Are you able to kind of give gift cards, per se, for some of the shows up yep. there, or what are the options? Yep, you can call in. You, for that, you would call the ticket office okay. at 515-294-2479, and we can get you a gift certificate. Okay, yep, all right. It can be turned Beautiful. in and used for any show. Okay, right. yep. very nice. Yeah, and then we go right into Dancing with the Stars. Uh, again, we're grouping our shows together. We have Dancing with the Stars on February 12th. Then we have Russian National Ballet, Swan Lake on the 13th. All right, and so then we're spending Valentine's Day with Finding Neverland. See that? Oh, Everything all that's together. That's a nice yes, little bundle yes, there. Yes, it is. N nice yes. packages that are going on. But these are just the shows that are coming up in the first couple of months. Yes, yes. And then we did just announce uh, Disney's Dance Upon a Dream with Mackenzie hmm. Ziegler. Okay. And so it's a new show, and it's all it's Disney music, and it's Disney video, and there's a lot of live dance and live music, and um, it's really for hmm. the tweens. And we're we're kind of excited to see that. We, that's, in the it'll spring be our first, time? In the springtime. Okay. That's March uh 12th, okay. right before spring break starts there for some is. people. Okay, yeah. so we have, we have your January figured out, we have your February, February figured, figured out, out, and we got your March something going for, already, something too. Something for everybody. Oh, I'm sorry, it wasn't March 12th. March 12th is uh, Waitress. <laughs> Okay. March 17th is Disney, Disney. Dance Upon a Dream, okay. and March 18th is Daniel Tiger's Neighborhood. Wow. Oh, yeah. there's another <laughs> good one for the kids. You guys are jam-packed. Yeah, we That's are. great. And we are. Always something great yes. going on, and of course, the venue, uh, what a great spot to watch a show. Yeah, it is. I mean, we're 50 years young, as we like to say. There's mm -hmm. still a lot of good bones in that building, and uh, it's just, it's a great place to see a show. The acoustics are great. Um, it, it's just the performers love being there because of the way the building looks and when they walk out on stage and that shows and it's a great it's a great building all right so let's review uh one more time this coming sunday. up this weekend yes. sunday, sunday 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 you'll be able to see this i'm gonna lady. i'm gonna, yeah. I'm gonna going take too. the girls i think up to yeah. that one yeah. that's gonna Good. be a great show yeah so magical sir christmas mm -hmm. 6 p.m sunday great Perfect. And Allison Cross tickets, if you try to get them on Friday and you wanted to get a group of them together and you couldn't, uh, there was try an again. issue. It has been corrected. Try again. Get your tickets, Allison Cross, before those are all gone. Yep. Sounds Perfect. good. Wonderful. Great. Good to see you. Thanks. Good Thank to be up so here much. again. Thank you so much. All right. It is 849 right now.